Ah, Paul. Couldn't sleep either. Just get some water. Your nan's very happy you're around for her birthday. So don't ruin it because of some stupid notion. You're wrong, Paul. I never saw Frank great, but it's great to have you here. You're not paying me enough for this. Yeah, of course you can have a fry up. Man after your own heart, Phil. Hey. It's all right. It, it happens to everyone. I thought you said you were late for work. Excuse me, Gordon. Oh, yeah. Bye. Go trouble, son. Is it any of your business? You know, it's so good to have us all together. Christmas is going to be perfect this year. Want any help, Paul? It's not breakfast in bed if you get up. It's your birthday, Birdie. Let him spoil you. Now, stop this, Paul. It's meant to be a happy day. Do you remember? when you used to let me sit on your lap and drive the hearse when I was a kid. We called it the Batmobile. I was Bruce Wayne. Yeah, and I was Alfred, the loyal butler. You were my hero. Were you a cheat then? Oh, don't be ridiculous. Look, tell me what you thought you saw. What, so you could deny it? I am so lucky. Having both my men here. It's the perfect birthday present. So, uh, Ben, uh, I'm saying you're a mechanic, like your dad. Yeah, that's right. Proper family business, eh, Dad? Yeah, there's not enough of that these days. <laughs> it's nice that Sharon followed in my footsteps. Wrong side of the bar, of course, eh? <laughs> Did I say something wrong? Touchy subject. Well, what's done is done. Now we just have to move on the best we can, eh? Look, I told you I'd get you another place. So today I'm taking you on the grand tour. Did you hear me? You're gonna show me old school and where me and Michelle used to hang out. Twice the size of the Albert and a better location. Well, it doesn't help me today, though, does it, Phil? Or tomorrow. So what do you want to do? Just play happy families? What, do you rather put me on reception down the arches? Anyway, it's not as if he's a stranger, is it? He's my dad, right? So, we're going to do the Grand Tour. We'll be in the Vic later if you can get away. OK? The difference between... Oh, hello, Lexi. She's, uh, she's grown. Yeah, that's what kids tend to do. <laughs> Sounds so rewarding. Yeah, right, I've got to drop her off anyway. You know, uh, things are going really well with Ben. Like, we're so in love. Oh, lovely. But uh, just to make things, you know, like, extra perfect, seeing as you know him quite well, I was wondering, is there anything in particular that he, uh, that he likes? Likes? <laughs> no, 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 it'd be me and him was a one-night stand, I wouldn't know. Oh, right, well, never mind then. I do know it's not your fault if things ain't working down there, right? <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I just mean it don't matter if you bust out the stockings and suspenders, it ain't gonna make a difference. It's just not what he's into, is it? There's no need to look so smug about it. 